Ankara, the heart of Turkey, became the site of a horrific terrorist attack. The target was TUSAS, a renowned Turkish defence firm. The assault sent shockwaves throughout the nation and beyond. The attack resulted in the tragic loss of innocent lives. The attackers aimed to sow fear and disrupt national security. The incident has raised serious questions about security measures. The attack has left an indelible mark on the Turkish psyche. In the immediate aftermath of the attack, the Kurdistan Workers' Party, or PKK, claimed responsibility. The PKK, designated as a terrorist organization by Turkey, the United States and the European Union, has been engaged in an armed struggle against the Turkish state for decades. The group cited Turkey's ongoing military operations against Kurdish militants in northern Iraq and Syria as the primary motivation for the attack. The PKK's claim of responsibility was met with widespread condemnation from the international community. World leaders denounced the attack as a barbaric act of violence and expressed solidarity with Turkey in its fight against terrorism. The attack served as a stark reminder of the global reach and indiscriminate nature of terrorism. The PKK's targeting of a defence firm like TUSAS underscores the group's evolving tactics and capabilities. The incident suggests a shift towards targeting strategic assets and infrastructure, potentially aiming to inflict maximum economic and psychological damage. This development raises concerns about the potential for future attacks on similar targets within Turkey and beyond. The Turkish government wasted no time in responding to the attack. Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan vowed a swift and decisive response, declaring that Turkey would not be intimidated by terrorism. Within hours, Turkish fighter jets launched airstrikes against suspected PKK hideouts in northern Iraq. Simultaneously, Turkish security forces conducted raids across the country, arresting dozens of suspected PKK members. The Turkish government's swift and forceful response reflects its zero-tolerance policy towards terrorism. Turkey has long maintained a policy of preemptive strikes against perceived threats to its national security. The attack on TUSAS, seen as an assault on the heart of Turkey's defence industry, triggered a robust military response. The airstrikes and raids demonstrate Turkey's determination to dismantle the PKK's operational capabilities and deter future attacks. Turkey has also called upon its international partners to take concrete actions against the PKK, including designating it as a terrorist organization and cutting off its sources of funding and support. The attack on Tusas has had far-reaching ramifications for Turkish national security and regional stability. The incident has exposed vulnerabilities in Turkey's security apparatus, prompting a comprehensive review of security measures at critical infrastructure and public spaces. The attack has also heightened tensions between Turkey and its neighbours, particularly Iraq and Syria, where the PKK maintains a significant presence. The attack on Tusas has highlighted the complex and interconnected nature of the security challenges facing Turkey. The incident underscores the need for a multifaceted approach to counter-terrorism, encompassing military operations, intelligence gathering and international cooperation. It also necessitates addressing the root causes of terrorism, including political grievances and socio-economic disparities. The attack has also raised concerns about the potential for spillover of violence from neighbouring Syria and Iraq, where the PKK operates. Turkey has long expressed concerns about the presence of Kurdish militants in these countries, fearing that they pose a direct threat to Turkish security. 
The attack on Tusas and the Turkish response are the latest in a decades-long conflict with the PKK. The PKK, formed in the 1970s, seeks greater autonomy for Turkey's Kurdish minority. The conflict has claimed tens of thousands of lives and displaced millions. Despite peace talks and ceasefires, the conflict remains unresolved. The attack on Tusas has dealt a severe blow to peace prospects. The urgent need for a peaceful resolution is clear. International Condemnation A unified front against terrorism The international community responded to the attack on Tusas with swift and unequivocal condemnation. World leaders expressed solidarity with Turkey and offered condolences to the families of the victims. The United States, a NATO ally of Turkey, condemned the attack as a heinous act of terrorism and reaffirmed its commitment to working with Turkey to combat terrorism in all its forms. The international community's condemnation of the attack on TUSAS highlights the global consensus against terrorism. The incident serves as a stark reminder that terrorism is a transnational threat that requires a coordinated international response. It also underscores the need for greater cooperation among nations in sharing intelligence, disrupting terrorist networks and addressing the root causes of extremism. The attack on Tusas has reinforced the importance of international cooperation in combating terrorism. The incident has prompted calls for enhanced intelligence sharing, joint counter-terrorism operations, and greater efforts to cut off terrorist financing. The PKK and Turkey, a history of violence and mistrust. The attack on Tusas is the latest episode in a long and bloody conflict between Turkey and the PKK. The PKK, founded in the 1970s, has been waging an armed struggle against the Turkish state for decades, seeking greater autonomy for Turkey's Kurdish minority. The conflict has claimed tens of thousands of lives and displaced millions more. The conflict between Turkey and the PKK is rooted in a complex web of historical grievances, political aspirations and ethnic tensions. The PKK accuses the Turkish government of suppressing Kurdish identity and culture, while Turkey views the PKK as a terrorist organization that threatens its national unity and territorial integrity. The attack on Tusas underscores the deep-seated mistrust and animosity that exists between Turkey and the PKK. The incident is a stark reminder of the challenges in finding a peaceful resolution to the conflict. A lasting peace will require dialogue compromise, and a willingness to address the legitimate grievances of all parties involved. The future of Turkish defence, strengthening security measures. The attack on Tusas has prompted a comprehensive review of security measures at critical infrastructure and public spaces in Turkey. The Turkish government has vowed to strengthen security at airports, seaports, power plants and other sensitive locations. The government has also announced plans to increase intelligence gathering and surveillance capabilities to better detect and prevent future attacks. The attack on Tusas has highlighted the need for a multi-layered approach to security, encompassing physical security measures, intelligence gathering and counter-terrorism operations. The incident has also underscored the importance of international